Hello everybody, this is Charles and I'm back with another chill cooking review This time for Super Robot Chill Cooking Solar Aquarion Yes, Solar Aquarion I just uh, got it yesterday and I'm really excited to bring you this review So here is Aquarion, alright uh, Before I go through the review, let me just go through um, the um, diecast content of this piece Basically, uh, quite uh, I would say fair amount of die cast, the joints for the shoulder pins, okay, connecting the shoulders and the arm are die cast. This side pieces of the lower leg, this white piece is die cast. And at the back, uh, this blue piece, uh, the heel is die cast. And also the joint for the hip and the legs are die cast. So apart from that, uh, no other die cast content. In terms of articulation wise, uh, he has a full range of motion. Uh, hip rotation wise, a little bit restricted. Here, okay, can you turn it a little bit here and there? Uh, don't really dare to attempt to turn it too much because I'm afraid I might break something. But uh, that's probably all there is to it. Shoulder wise, you can actually move this up. So that you can actually move this uh, for more shoulder articulation. It allows you to raise the arm this high, right? Shoulders wise, uh, you can also move freely up and down. In fact, it's on the ball joint, so it's pretty much easy to move. Uh, elbows, you can move them, rotate them. Uh, single elbow joint, no double joint. Wrist, full 360 rotation. Uh, the waist, you can see, can move uh, pretty freely. And the waist compartment, you can actually raise it up, okay, and uh, raise this much. So there is quite a lot of uh, articulation for the waist. I think it's like a 1.2, two points of articulation for the waist that allows you to extend itself. Uh, in terms of the legs, you can move the skirt sideways. You can move the legs all the way up. You can move so much because there is no restriction on on your side skirts or anything. Uh, moving sideways is this much. You can rotate the thighs, and as per all SRCs now, you have double jointed knees, and this is clicky for the lower knees, so that's really really cool. Uh, for kneecaps, you can actually move these pieces, and uh, for the toes, a very wide range of motion that you have over here, as you can see. So yes, let me just give you a demonstration. You know, like this is how much you can pose. Really, really open up wide. Uh, haven't tried the kneeling pose before, but I'm gonna try it right now. I think it should be very, very simple to do. And yeah, you pretty much do a kneeling pose very, very easily due to the way of nature of the joint. Yeah, you know, it's like for me, in terms of articulation, one of the standards is like uh, if you can do a very easy and good kneeling pose, you're almost there. You're a good product. Um, so this guy is um, lanky, yeah, slim and lanky, but that's the way uh, Solar Acheron is. And oops, oops, sorry about that. And it comes with the wings, you know, the wing parts, yes. So wing parts fit in the back. Over here, just slot it in. And there is a joint over here, this uh, black part, that allows you to hold the wing in place. See, just slot it in, it's very easy. Uh, fit this in. You know this really feels like Rebel, Rebel, Rebel Tech joint to me, to be honest. Just push this in and then slot this part in and we are done. Okay, there's a lot of points of articulation for this piece. So many that I can't really name it but no, this is uh, what you have. It's really really very cool. You know, despite the fact that Aquaron doesn't have a uh, double jointed elbows, it doesn't restrict its motion. In fact, it still has a full range of motion. I'm really, really impressed, you know, by the amount of articulation he has. Just look at this. No, it's really, really a lot of articulation. Double jointed knees, full range of motion. You know, it's really, really cool. And the side wings, you can actually move them freely as you want. See? It's up to your imagination how much you want to move them. So it's really, really very, very cool. It comes with uh, two sets of fists. Uh, this is like open, open fists. Okay, which I will just change one of them. And it also comes with um, a set of fists to hold the sword. So let's just change one of each for demonstration purposes. Okay, so we just want to take this out. I'm gonna put this open fist here. Take this out, put this closed fist, uh, sorry, this uh, open fist, say open fist, the fist that holds the sword. 
It comes with one weapon and that is the Sword of Solar Acheron. Alright. Get him inside. <coughs> okay. And there you have it. Solar Acheron. Wow. Look at this. Really, really cool. Really, really impressive. I like the amount of articulation this guy has and the possibility is really really awesome look at this whoa it's really awesome the amount of poses you can get with this guy and uh, to release his uh, wings in full burst mode I don't know what you call that but uh, I call it full burst mode it's very simple just extend the wings opening up turn it over here likewise for the back Okay, instruction says to extend all this out all right flip this part open okay turn this around and there you have Acheron with all his wings open up and the very very nice thing about the wings you know is that inside it's chrome it's gold red and orange chrome so I'm really really impressed by this and um, to make sure that the wings hold themselves well notice over here there's a black hole okay and there's a pin over here at the bottom so when you are not uh, you're gonna close them you don't have to worry about the wings being like open this way it looks really ugly you just need to align them all right oops this part just fell off sorry about that Let me just put this back in first Okay, you just need to align them, find a catch, close them, and your wings will be tight. No, do not flimsy at all. So it's really, really, really very nice. Let me just um, open up the wings again. Alright. And uh, display Acheron in his full glory. Yes. So this is really, really very cool. I love the chrome wings. It's really, really very, very nice. And it comes with another feature as well, which is the Infinity Punch. I hope I got the name correct. So this is the Giant Punch. It comes with uh, this set of parts. Okay, let's move into the back first. This set of parts is very simple. Just put them together. One, two, three. Put them all together. And you put the fist inside here, this giant fist inside here. It comes with this stand, a three part stand that you can assemble. You know, I actually assembled it before the review. And uh, take this out. Okay, what I'll do is just put the fist here, connect it, right? And there's a hole here to put this stand in. And there you have it, Acheron's Infinity Punch. I really, really like the fact that they gave a big fist because it gives a very 3D feel. See, like the way you see in this video right now, it has a very 3D feel. Like the punch is coming at you all the way. See, especially this view is coming at you. The punch is coming at you right out of the screen. So it's really, really a very nice touch. No, I, I really, really like this. Um, pardon me for that. Uh, I've been shifting the, p the parts too much. So let me just um, get this back up first. Let me just get the wing back first. So the wing generally, yeah, it's all on ball joints. It doesn't fall easily. Just that I'm just, I just that I turned them too much and you know, it fell off a little bit. Let me just put this punch back the hole. Um, put this back here, and there we have it in place. Infinity punch. Really, really nice feature. So yes, Acheron. You know, Solar Acheron is really, really a very nice piece. I, I love him. The articulation is there. There's so many points of articulation due to the engineering of this piece. And it's really a lot of free motion because of the design of the robot. There's no skirts to actually block his motion. So it's really, really very cool. And I, I, I really like this pose. You know, I'm just going to leave him with this pose. Yeah, this 3D punching out of the screen pose. It's really, really very, very nice. I love it. This giant punch. All right, so uh, Acheron is a very, is a very, very popular piece right now. I think it's sold out in quite a number of places. Uh, if you'd like to get your piece, please visit iShop2Go.com. They have a lot of uh, super robot chill cooking toys, SIC toys, and other robot toys. So do visit them for your chill cooking needs. 
Alright, so here's Charles signing off with yet another choking review. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Do stay tuned to my channel as I'll bring you more reviews again next time. And till next time, watch out and eat this infinity punch!